with the Gateway Arch welcoming us in the background to look at Bush Stadium in St. Louis. And before we close in on first pitch, a look at the starting lineups here for the finale. Chris Miller, check on Fowler, now here it comes. And a swing and a miss as they got him with the slider there, two away. Well, there's very few things that can happen negatively with... And they were simply not going to give him anything there with the base open. It's a four pitch. Chris Miller. Swinging a tapper out in front. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Chris Miller will stand in now. And this is swung on and missed. And boy, they took care of a key man there. Chris Miller will stand in, and they've been all the strikeouts so far. It seems like it's been a growing trend so far, but man. And they will put the tag on him. They got him, and with that, the... Red Sox have the lead. 5-2 Boston. Victorino pumping his fist as he rounded first base. It's been a hundred years of baseball and counting at this place, and the charm hasn't faded a bit at venerable Wrigley Field in Chicago. And before we get too much further, here's a look at each manager's starting lineup here for the opener. Chris Miller will dig in for the first time. Now a bouncing ball for the shortstop, Kozart. Throw on to Votto will take care of him at first, and the side is retired. Factor much into the win yesterday as he took an 0 for 4 in the ball game. And he gets around on the fastball here as this is hit fairly well out toward left field. Miller is going to get back, and he'll put this one away on the warning track. Make the play on the warning track. And a fastball here is swung on and lifted in the air to left. Miller is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. To the bottom of the fourth now, still with no score. And he waits on the changeup there and pulls it to fairly deep right field. Bruce has to range back a ways, but he makes the catch in front of the Ivy for out number two. Well, we're, we're... Frazier will make his way towards the box to lead off the fifth. Changed up on him there, but it's hit pretty well out toward deep left field. Miller is back near the Ivy as he makes the catch for the first for ballparks from one day to the next. And a fastball swung on and hit in the air to left. Miller is in his tracks now as he makes the catch for out number two. And no tag at Chris Miller. Now he tries to hold back on the swing, and the home plate umpire says he did so. Out and popped out so far. Swing and a ball yanked down the right field line. And that's a fair ball heading out toward the 353 sign on the Ivy. Around third and being waved on home. And now a ball hit fairly well here out to the deep part of left field. Miller is back near the Ivy as he makes the catch for the first out. Chris Miller. Pitch. Hey, your pitch. They are Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. Here's a fastball that swung on and hit pretty well out to deep left field. And he'll put this one away without much trouble, and the Cubs. 2,800 Raiders. Line drive, base hit, there it is. 4,000 hits. Janssen. On the run, on the run, way back, he does. He caught it, he caught it. It's a diving, spectacular catch. So we're going to see a pinch hitter here with the bases empty and one gone in the inning comes the one two pitch in the dirt is swung on and missed so he'll need to get the force at first throw to first will take care of him score it two to three on the put out goodness gracious what a night there are few better places in America to spend an afternoon than this place right here and before we close in on first pitch a look at the starting lineups here for the finale Chris Miller will get his first, the 1-1. Now he goes the other way with a fastball, and he got a lot of it high and deep to left center field. 
Now a leaping effort at the wall, but he comes up empty. This one is gone. Home run. So a two-run shot to left center. Number 18 for him on the campaign. And the Cubs have made this a 3-2 ball game. And if he was guessing up there, he was guessing right because he's all over that thing like a shaggy dog. And he drives it over the wall. Chris Miller. Much easier to get a better view of it and then just lay off. Oh, and this one has hit a ton out to center. Racing back the center fielder. And he's not going to get there. It's going to one-hop the wall. And he is in at second base with a one-out double. Oh, darn near had his second home run of the ball game. You see, this thing bangs off the wall out there. He's into second with a double. Chris Miller. And this is swung on and bounced to shortstop. On to first by Ryan, and there's the first out of the inning. You know. And a fastball swung on and hit in the air to left. Miller is right there as he puts it away. No problem for the first down. And the runner, not tagging, will retreat to second base. Chris Miller. Back here for the eighth inning. I would have thought seven innings would have been enough, but knowing this guy, he may have talked his manager into letting him stay and go out there for one more inning. Yeah, he's swinging a pretty hot bat here. Three for four now after the base hit. That wasn't a little bleeder. That ball was smoked. Of the field. How majestic was that? It's a shame that it hit that catwalk because I would have loved to see how far that... It's been a hundred years of baseball and counting at this place, and the charm hasn't faded a bit at venerable Wrigley Field in Chicago. And before we get too much further, here's a look at each manager's starting lineup here for the opener. And he gets some pretty good wood on it here as this is lifted to fairly deep left. Miller will get there and he puts it away to retire. The Cubs turn in a scoreless ball game. Oh, got his pitch on three and one, but this is a routine fly ball out to straightaway center. There to take it in is McCutcheon now for route number two. Chris Miller. Anything out there. There's another pitch right down the middle. And I think he's lucky that that one didn't get hit a long way. Kadire is there and he puts it away to stop the bleed. Chris Miller. He's got a big hole on that right side of the infield. Hard hit towards center. McCutcheon is going to have room out there as he puts this away. Four to nothing. Chris Miller. Now he turns on one and rips it down the line. And this is going to get past him at first. That's a fair ball. And they'll add another as this is now a 5 nothing game. And he is in the second base. Now a breaking ball hit on the ground to short. Throw to first. Not in time as the run is across to score. Chances of getting back into this ball game are growing dimmer by the batter. Now a fastball as this is hit fairly well out toward left center. And he will make the catch just shy of the track in the end. Chris Miller. Right down the middle and grab a strike. Can't be a giveaway pitch. Now a hard liner towards short. And this gets right through him, and that may be a run. Around third and being waved on home. And he will score as well. And they're really putting some distance between him now as that lead gets even bigger. Boy, that's a tough time out there for your outfield to let you down. Two runs are going to come in to score on the play, and that was just a total lack of concentration. That's embarrassing. And I think you appreciate that as a pitcher, but sometimes when you don't have it, you don't have it. it looks like this is going to be one of those times. And this is turning ugly now as this ball's down for extra bases. And he is in the second base with an RBI double. They haven't done anything with their opportunities so far. Maybe this will be the time that they finally crack the scoreboard. Miller will drift over to his right a few steps as he takes it for the second out. And no tag at second. He'll head back there with two away now. Home run by Juan Uribe. 
Still two and two to Alonso. Posey's thinking. We got pretty good wood on that one. Do I throw it again? Do I throw the split? Now from the windy city of Chicago, there's a beautiful look at fabled Wrigley Field. And with first pitch just moments away, here's a look at today's starting lineups. Chris Miller. Now a ball lifted high in the air towards shallow right center field. Abreu retreats to the outfield grass, and he has it for round number one. Chris Miller. Very good knowledge of the strike zone, and he knows when to lay off. And this is swung on and missed, though the ball did hit the ground, so we'll need to go to first. And the throw is in time. Wilson Ramos will dig in. He singled his first time around. Line hard into left. Miller is right there as he puts it away. No problem for the first down. And his average is going to go down. Now a slider that swung on and hit in the air out toward left. Miller has him played perfectly as he puts it away for out number one. And the runner, not tagging, will... Chris Miller. Come on, fellas, let's go. Here we go. Now a ball swung on and taken the opposite way out toward fairly deep left center. Marte, a range to his left as he tracks this one down. Hey, come on now, guys. Wait. In the air to left center. Miller will range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the... That swing's basically all arms. So far for the Cubbies. Swing and he shatters the bat as this is hit on the ground. Throw won't be in time as he reaches it first. So far. Hey, we got one here. And now a swing and a ball hit in the air out to left field. Miller is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Chris Miller. Runner not going anywhere at second. Now the pitch. Now this pitch is lined into left center field. That's a base hit. A spectacular catch, and the Dodgers win. Is it possible to have a walk-off win on a catch? Dodgers just got one. Well, Venable. There are few better places in America to spend an afternoon than this place right here. And before we close in on first pitch, a look at the starting lineups here for the finale. Chris Miller. Ball will be jumping, so you've got to keep that ball in the park today. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground is short. On to Moss at first, and the inning is over. Nothing in the cup. Chris Miller. And they are still hitless, but at least they'll have a base runner here. It's ball. Payoff pitch coming. He'll try it again from first. It's strike three called. The throw. Not in time as he steals second. Pounds. And a good pitch, but he gets quite a lot of it as this one's hit in the air to deep left field. And in fact, he got more than a lot of it. He got all of it. It's a home run for him on the campaign as the Cubs are out in front now two to nothing. Big swing there as it's hit pretty well out toward deep left field. Miller retreats to the track and he'll put Chris Miller. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends They're the up two to nothing. He's still got a couple pitches to play with, but I'd expect this one to be somewhere in a... And meanwhile now, here's a drive out to right center. And this ball is going to clear the wall. It's a home run. So a three-run shot to right center field. 19th home run for him on the season. As they pile on, it's now six to nothing. And if he was guessing up there, he was guessing right because he's all over that thing like a shaggy dog and he drives it over the wall. Game. Race win! Race win! Race win! Five to four! Five previous no-hitters and the second perfect game. Gonzalez up the middle, base hit! Swinging, Marwin Gonzalez right back through the wickets and the no-hitter, and 
perfect game are gone.